Yaho YouTube, I am Super Yankee and in today's video I'm going to the Big Red Bus again. It's funny because I just donated like two weeks ago but these guys, they're aggressive. No, they're not aggressive, they're assertive and they want you to donate. And you can donate every two weeks, just not whole blood, platelets. So we're gonna go talk to the man over here right now, see what it's all about, see if we can get some video footage, some good stuff and uh, yeah, promote one blood. Tell me some of the benefits of donating plasma. Plasma or yeah. platelets? Platelets, platelets. Platelets? Yeah. Um, for the donor? Yeah. Well, for the donor, you don't feel as fatigued afterwards. Uh, mm -hmm. It's a little bit less invasive on the body. We're taking out just the one component of the blood cell inside of the entire blood cell. Mm -hmm. uh, that basically helps control bleeding, right? Like, well, you get them back within seven days rather than 56 days. Okay. The benefits for the recipient, it's coming from one source rather than six different sources. What I mean by that is it usually takes about six pints of whole blood to make one pint of platelets. Wow. So instead of taking them from six different other pints of blood, we get them from one person, it's a little bit safer for the recipient. Uh, that way we don't have to go searching for different blood types, uh, different antigens and things like that. We can just get them from one person. The benefit for you, you're helping out cancer patients, it's a little bit more out of there. But on top of that, the physical aspects, you don't feel as fatigued, you get them back much quicker. And during the procedure itself, you're hooked up to a saline solution too, so you feel hydrated throughout the entirety of the okay. day. Small needle too, for all those uh, yeah. <laughs> out Right, that's what I was saying last time. You want to do something with your Saturday? Donate blood, conquer your fear needles. Yeah. You know, it does take a little bit longer. That's the one downside of it. It does take about an hour, but... It I takes an hour? It takes an hour, but the only reason being is because we separate the cell. We're still taking about the same amount, but because we have to separate the cell. Remember, it takes about six pints of whole blood to make one pint of platelets. We have to go through about six pints of blood to get through that one pint of platelets. Okay. So, wait, do you have to be hooked up to the IV for an hour then? Yeah. But it's not a tough procedure. I mean, I do it about once a month, you know, time allows me to. Um, Ooh, an hour though. What would I be doing for an hour? I mean, I guess I could do it for an hour. Yeah. It's an hour's not that bad. It's not that bad. No, I mean, it, the good thing is that hour that you're sacrificing, you give it somebody, because the people that receive platelets, they usually have to get them on a, a once every 10 to 14 day basis. Yeah. So you're giving somebody an extra week, two weeks of, uh, of a comfortable living, right? as comfortable as they can be. Right. The people going through chemo, they have to get platelets every time they go through chemo. Wow. Leukemia patients, if I'm not mistaken, they have to get them that once a 10 to 14 day basis. Okay. So it's a, it's a huge, huge job. And it's something that we do need a lot of in the state of Florida right okay. now. Okay. One downside about the platelets is they only last about five days outside of the human body. So the shelf okay. life for them is minimal. You know, we have to use them immediately. Yeah. But that being said, anything that we do get, it goes a long, long way. Good, let's go then. Let's do this. Yeah. Do you have an idea with you? I do have an idea with me. What's your name? Super Genki. Super what? Super Genki. Super Genki? Yeah. So, uh, what is that? Super means super in Japanese. Genki means energetic or charismatic. Life turns into a lifestyle. Get Genki. There you go. It's all about that. YouTube man, platelets and plasma is a lot of hard work. I'm like hooked up to this IV and I am doing stuff right now. I have to squeeze this ball every time it says draw, which means I have to pay attention to the screen over there, which means like, hey, get Genki. This thing is like, it's the hardest video game I've ever played in my life. Yeah. Uh, you have to squeeze, you have to draw and return, and then when you don't draw, it's gonna like beep at you, and it's gonna be like, you have to do it all over again. And oh my god. And no, I lost. I lost the game, now I'm back. There it says draw. It says draw, we gotta draw. Use all of our Genki power to draw. We're almost there. Oh, we gotta draw, we gotta draw. You see, when that, when that green line goes down, it means it's time to draw. So thank you. I'm trying my best, I'm trying my best, I don't want to fail again. I don't want to fail again. It's a race against time. It's a race against time. The top bar is my is my progression rate. So that's how, how far I've gotten since I started playing this game. But yeah, the green one indicates your failure rate, like how close you are to failing. And then those are platelets and those are, what's the other one? Plasma. I already finished my plasma, I'm doing my platelets. Okay, thank you. But remember, it's not about us, it's about others. We do this for other people. Get Genki. Draw. Draw, 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 draw. This one's much bigger than the last one I got. bit I guess and then we'll talk about our post donating kind of thing our post donating feeling 
something that like occurred to me more than anything this time around I don't know because like every single time is different I don't know what it is but it just it really does put you in a different perspective what I realized this time is that yeah the movie tickets are nice the food is nice and I mean it, it feels nice to donate blood but it's really not about you it's about the people you're helping that's what you want to focus on because I know it's not necessarily easy to want to go spend an hour of your life donating blood, but it's not about us. It's not about you, it's not about your time. It's about the people you're helping. This is something that I really do believe we have to learn to incorporate into our life if we really want to help people. You know, Mahatma Gandhi said this. He said, if you really want to find yourself, lose yourself in the service of others. And, I mean, yes, it's donating blood, yes, it's small scale, but you do help people. And every little step you take trying to get better, every little step you take trying to help more people, those steps stack up, and that's what builds the big change that happens later on. Definitely, YouTube, I recommend checking it out. These one blood buses are here very frequently. I totally did not expect to encounter one today. Literally, it was coming back from my... My, what was I doing earlier? Yes, my visa application thing. And I just saw it and then I went to the gym and then I came back and I was like, I'm doing this. So yeah, if this video helped you out, if this video made you want to donate some blood, don't forget to smash that like button. It would really help me out. Subscribe to the channel. Really want to get to 100,000 subscribers before I'm 25, 23 right now. Leave a comment because I love responding to you guys with positivity and ganky energy. And most importantly, share this video with your friends. We need to get the good word of positive thinking out there to as many people as possible. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.